Hey guys, how's it going? So today I want to do a kind of a day in the life of the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus. Uh, this will be kind of like a battery test pretty much, uh, showcasing uh, pretty much a day in the life of the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus. Uh, who would have thought, right? Um, I didn't want to do a battery test when I first got the phone because obviously it's going to be amazing. Like it's going to be, you know, not used or anything. Uh, but two months down, you know, two months later down the line, uh, let's see if battery life changed at all, you know, big, small changes, whatever. Uh, we're going to see it today. So right now it is 9, 10 in the morning. I'm going to have my breakfast. Um, and when I watch, or when I watch, when I eat breakfast, I like to watch a little bit of YouTube. Uh, so right now the battery is at 100%. Uh, so I'm going to watch a little bit of YouTube, listen to some music. And then uh, whenever I finish up my breakfast and whenever I do the dishes and everything, I will give you guys an update. And then we're going to go out, explore the wonderful city of Palm Coast, which is a really boring city. But we're, we're going to see how it works and we're going to see the, the battery life of this beast two months later. So let's begin. So that took a little longer than expected. <laughs> Usually it would take like 45 minutes to get everything done and ready for. Uh, but my microphone stopped working right as I was trying to do like the next bit. Uh, so that took a little bit long time to find out what was going on. But in the meantime of me doing that, again, I was watching YouTube. I played a little bit of uh, Injustice, went back to YouTube, scrolled through social media a little bit. So long story short, it is now 11.05. What is it? It's 11.07 in the morning, so pretty much two hours later, and my battery's at 92%. Not bad, to be honest, uh, for the amount of stuff that I did. I played like six rounds of Injustice. I watched YouTube for about uh, 30 minutes, I want to say, and uh, which actually reminds me I got to make a phone call because the AC in my car took a dump, and I'm, I'm in Florida, which is the devil's armpit, so I got to set up an appointment to get that fixed which is gonna be good so i'm gonna make a phone call right now all right so i gave them a call the earliest they can see me is next tuesday and today is thursday so i just got a little bit longer to not kill myself from sitting in this car and sweating so but right now we're going to target again i'm gonna use my gps it is about 13 minutes away 5.7 miles uh so we're gonna see right now it is uh 11 23 and the battery's at 90%. So let's see what it is when we get there to Target. So let's begin. All right, so we made it to Target. And uh, so it's been about 13 minutes. It is, uh, let's see, it is 11.37. The battery's at 88%. So 2% in 13 minutes of using GPS and listening to music via Bluetooth. That's not bad. I mean, um, I've seen uh, some other videos. I think your average consumer made a video of him going like 30 minutes and he lost like 15% of uh, GPS or 15% of battery. I don't see how, like that's a lot. Now, that's a problem with the phone, I think, because I just lost 2% in 13 minutes. So, and listening to music. So I'm gonna go into uh, Target. I'm gonna shop around. Uh, Target usually gets very bad reception and reception kills battery. But hey, this is an everyday kind of your average test. So. It's perfect to see what the battery will be when I come out. So right now, it's like, like I said, it's 1137 and the battery is at 88%. So we'll be back and we'll see what it is. So I'm recording this on the Samsung Galaxy S10 just to waste a little bit more battery because it is 1218 and I'm at 84%. Uh, so this battery is going down so slow, like I'm trying to kill it. So that's why I'm recording this. When I came back from Target, I got uh, more goodies to review and to keep because I kind of want this for some reason. I don't know why. But I got the Ring Doorbell, or not Ring Doorbell, the, the Nest uh, Outdoor Camera. I didn't want to get the doorbell because my doorbell faces parallel to a wall. And then the outside is... Who's calling me? My mom's calling me. Hang on. Back to what I was saying, uh, if I put the ring doorbell, it's, it's, it's going to look at a wall because the outside is like this way and it's going to be facing this way. So that won't really work. So I got the, the, this thing instead and I can just place it 
in a and well, realistically in any spot I want and it's perfect because I also got the Google Home and if anyone you know walks through that area it'll automatically go up on my Google Home so it's pretty good uh, to waste more time to drain the battery let's go to the beach I think if it doesn't rain so I just got home the battery well right now it is 1237 and the battery is at 80% I did use GPS back to my place uh, again, I know where I live, but again, I just wanted to test out the extent of this battery. Uh, so, in fact, it's so good, I'm actually going to do an unboxing of the Nest from this camera right there. Uh, in the meanwhile, while I'm doing that, I'm going to let uh, Netflix play on the Samsung for however long it takes me to do the unboxing. And then I'm just going to, you know, play a few games, you know, browse on my social media, look at more some, uh, look at more YouTube stuff like that and then uh, i'll update you guys later on and we'll see how it goes i swear this phone just doesn't know how to die it, it, it's crazy right now it's 4 40 uh, p.m so it's been about a little more than four hours since my last update and uh, i'm at 53 percent. you guys can't see it but i'm at 53 percent uh, so during those four hours um, i made the unboxing video i uh, did uh, two i think two hours of um Game of Thrones and then I also watched a few YouTube videos and then overall just normal usage with the phone and again 53% uh, four hours later so that's that's pretty crazy um, so I'll keep updating you guys as they as the day goes on I might actually go to the to the beach uh, in, in a few hours so I'll take a few you know videos a few photos with the phone to see if that really drains any the battery any more or less uh, but hopefully it doesn't rain. It's been like raining all, like day, like uh, on and off all day, so. So I'm recording with the Galaxy again, going to the beach. It's 6.37 p.m. and the battery is at 43%. I'm telling you, like it's, you have to be pretty much playing games all day to kill this battery, it's insane. So uh, after this video, I'm gonna turn on the GPS to go to the beach. And I'm gonna listen to some music as well, and we'll see if that does anything. <laughs> so, oh boy, this battery's too big, said no one ever. I made it to the beach. It is, let's see, it's 7.06 and the battery's at 37%. So, I'm just literally in shock at how well this battery is. It's, it's stupid. so privileged to live right next to the beach because you won't get that anywhere else it's amazing well guys i guess that's it for the day it is 8 8 p.m and the battery is still at 29 percent so this is around the time that i usually get home regardless and i still got you know 29 percent left so it's amazing i mean this phone is you have to like, like i said you have to be playing games like all day to kill this battery so let me know what you guys thought let me know your experience on the galaxy s10 plus are you guys seeing similar battery or worse better let me know in the comment section below if you guys are looking for cases there i have 10 percent off of rhino shield cases again in the links below always check the links below there's always going to be some goodies there regardless uh so yeah guys that's pretty much it i'm gonna go in take a shower eat watch some more game of thrones <laughs> and then go to bed so, adios.